Hello everyone, welcome back to another weather episode of Pokemon Emerald. Last time with you guys all, we first took care of Maxi from Team Magma, and he goes out Groudon. So now we are here to stop the endeavors of Team Magma. Now one thing I want, I want to go on to say right now is you probably have noticed by now, the my subbar says Steven for Pelipper. If not, look at it now. Because I now have changed my Pelipper's name from Steve to Steven. It doesn't change much or anything, but I just want you guys to know. So I'll be right back into our heel. Okay, now, um, we're probably wondering why we're in the sleep port, because this is the next objective. To see what's going on at the sleep port, uh... What's this place again? The shipyard, or the harbor, whatever you want to call it. This is where the submarine is supposed to well, launch today. So let's see what's going on up here. Let's see what's going on up here. Let's see, yes indeed, we intend to move the Haywire Exploration. That's wonderful, Captain Star. Thank you so much for taking time from your business schedule to talk to us. We hope that uh, we can interview you again with the news and more discoveries. And get me a tie just walk off. Whew. That was my first time being uh, to be filmed by TV. For TV, that was nerve wracking. Oh, Jeremy, you're looking great. You made a huge discovery our last super exploration. We found an underwater cavern on Route 28. We think it's a habit. We think it's a habit of Pokemon that should have been on the stink. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Captain Stern and I presume we have all team we all we have team up with a super trolley submarine. Your objections are meaningless. We expect a total cooperation. Ooh, ooh, just watch and learn what team up can pass plan. What was all that about? Sound like someone who's in the megaphone. Where did it come from? It's one of horror! Everybody, go inside the building! <laughs> and that's some really weird, interesting. And here's our idol. You're my idol, Archer! What did you do this for? <laughs> okay, that is stupid now. You are tenacious to track us here. That much I give you. But now, no one can stop us. No one! Or will you follow us back to our hideout in Lily Cove City? Now, I got something to say. Um, you have actually noticed something different about Archie and Maxi. That is actually really different, different about these two. And um, if you haven't noticed it by now, um, it's the fact that Archie seems a lot more bent on trying to get his goal, while Maxi seems to be more of a like a like a, it's like a Messiah mission, if I can say that much. Like. He's, he doesn't really want to, it doesn't sound like he really wants to hurt anybody, but the process he will, Ar well actually no, to be more specific, Archie seems more like no one, if he, has, if he has to, he will destroy everybody in his path to get his, um, to get his goal accomplished. Now, he seems to be crazy right now, um, Max, on the other hand, if you notice, Max, he seems to have a mind, and by that I mean, he thinks, he seems to have thought things through, as he's saying that, Something is wrong with your auto lens, for instance. Uh, now this is something that when that when that happened in Pokemon Ruby and Sapphire, Ruby, you will actually have the events of Maxi taking the uh, submarine. While in the events of uh, Sapphire, you'll have the events of um, let's say it again. So Ruby, Sapphire, you'll have Team Aqua taking the events of here. So yeah, now that Aqua's high up, they're not blocking us anymore. So we are now able to pretty much uh, take care of some events that we have yet to take care of. So. Right now I'm gonna go through this, gonna go through another door in here because this is Team Aqua's hideout. See what do I have? In my, what do I have first? Uh, well, yeah, let's keep let's keep Ness out there. It, it shouldn't hurt us too much anyway to keep him out there. And now we have two teleportation puzzles uh, panels. Which I hate the most. It was this. You found a max elixir. That's pretty good. Okay, now let's use the other. One. Use this other one now. I'm gonna take some time. I'm gonna take some time out to talk about a few things, such as let's play in general. Um, pretty much it's come to try with. It's probably come to a lot of people's attention, at least for LP for that matter. This channel, uh, I think Jerry from JG. He has brought to the attention that um, well, this isn't really a problem, but it's not something he noticed. Like it's, it's like people aren't doing let's play to be let's play anymore. It's more than doing it for attention. Now, there's actually, there's actually something totally wrong, but also right with the statement. Now, what's totally wrong with the statement is that it's kind of almost categorizing. Now, this is something that I don't want to say that he's doing this or something like that, but 
I'm saying he's like he's kind of categorized a bunch of old peers, but he probably he's, he wasn't. This is probably not his intention. But to me, it's not like he categorized quite a bit of old peers to be doing this. Well, um, if he has not been categorizing like that, then it's pretty good. But um, since he's categorized quite a few less players, basically he names other ways categorized us, us players who are doing this is to be people who are doing this for the wrong reasons. While the prime aren't doing this is because their views are getting nothing or getting nowhere and to be completely honest, if you're making a let's play, would you honestly want to take your time out to do these things and you haven't even gotten one view because I've actually had that happen to me a couple times. Like before I even started this game, the game part nine, which I gotta say is a really successful channel so far. Um I had really no, I had actually no subscribers, I probably had one or two, and I and I honestly think I, it was my choice to start over again because I think it's the best to start over and get a feel for um, what's to come and everything because I have been completely low. I actually did leave one over here. Well, actually, two of these things are designed well, two of them are as an electro, so I think Nugget, we set up for 10, only set up for 5,000 Pokedowns, and I think this is the Master Ball, yes! Now, these right here are electro, so I'm not gonna bother with them. I was gonna say, in Pokemon in Ruby Sapphire, if you don't come to this room, and you beat, and you beat Archie and leave, or you beat Maxi and leave, you will never get the chance to come back in here. I know it's a really weird design choice, but it was their design choice. Let's see here. Yeah, I'm hoping that it's a different way you're supposed to be able to do this. Let's see what you're supposed to do this. It's supposed to, and it's supposed to land you. Okay, I'm just not doing this wrong. I'm listening to my, I'm listening to guys' time, not knowing how to do this. This is why I'm bad at teleportation puzzles. I really am. I ain't really bad at these things. I really am. Still over here. I'm oh, sorry. You know what's going over here yet? Okay, that was something extra. Never mind. Sorry about that. I really screwed that up. Okay, this is where we're supposed to go. So I'm gonna skip this right now. It has been brought to my attention that Pro Balls are gonna be doing. Okay! Our head out secret. Well, let's just say there's some ring at the far end, but by what by, by now, key, key, key. Okay? And there's actually a really random instance of a cut in the video. I apologize. I've accidentally hit the stop button. That is that there is a random cut. This video, what you guys know. Uh, let's see what's up. Okay, I think I was to hit up here. I can't wrong about that, but I don't think I am. Okay, uh, like I said, swing turns are not required, and it's best not to. If you see that room we went to, you would have thought you would have saw the area like, how are you supposed to get there? Well, the way I did it, you'll be able to get there now. I kind of did that all as an accident. Okay, this is right. This is a required turn about him. Uh, so we're gonna switch in. Kano. I need to go get rid of his orb. Why well, one of those, like, if you guys, do you, um, give me an idea. Would it be, um, this is, this is actually a move I can actually give Sceptile in replace of, um, of Exorb, and I'm thinking it may be useful. But Dynamic Punch would be a really good move, even though I'm not gonna be able to get stabbed from it to teach to, um, uh, what do I say? And try to teach to subtile because I need to get rid of Zora. I don't need to. I don't need two healing moves on me. Let's see. We're gonna go for a psychic on you, and we're gonna go for a thunderbolt on you. Hey, I love being an attack burst. So you can teach freaking no attack Pokemon any, any move in the world. But uh, this is what makes. This Pokemon probably is the best HM move with this thing. Uh, HM Slate, this thing can learn all the hit teams, I think. Speaking of move, speaking of levels, this thing. <coughs> my Kano is freaking out. Uh, Such so are on the same level. I had no idea. <coughs> okay. <laughs> What's this thing you use pre Power Slater? Well, never mind then. Hey, what was up that instance of lag? I just. And there's this one guy, and I was gonna say, I told you before that it was, a, it was a equivalent to Tabitha, right, for Team Aqua. This is him. Hey, 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 I got here, got here already, did you? Let us made it to you. 
but this is it. This is it! I'm sorry. <laughs> oh, man. I'm gonna get a lot of hate mail for that. And it has Aqua, 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 Aqua Admin Mac. I completely forgot it existed. I'm not kidding you. I forgot he existed. So, this is actually rather embarrassing for me. <laughs> oh, man. I forgot this guy existed. So, uh, we're gonna go for, um... Actually, I'm gonna put one on the same level as, 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 as such a... What am I talking about? Uh, we're gonna go for flying right here. You know, it's not fast. I'm not fast in this thing. And hopefully, he won't go for a swagger. Just like saying, he's gonna go for... Just as soon as I say he goes for I was hoping I was, I was gonna get lucky and he was gonna fall what I said. Oh, great. So I hope it's gonna hurt with an earthquake. Yeah, I don't wanna hit myself, so we're gonna go. Know it? Take down. And this would have been a good move to use if I was a ghost type. Which I am not. Please, please. Yes! Yes! Take that, Mariana! Take that! Okay. I said, take that, Mariana! Okay, uh, he has a gold bag, which is really weird that he has a gold bag. I'm gonna go for you. Get the quick table out off, I mean, don't get stabbed, I mean, it's really good move. Like I said, like, well, you know, it's not a bad Pokemon, I mean, as long as, as, long as he's used the right, um, as long as he's being used in the right situations, he's a pretty good Pokemon to use. And I will be doing that secret power thing, and I probably did, well, I did more than half. But, uh, of course there's a super potion this late in the game. They have a super potion this late in the game, and this is the first time in all time ever going to meet you. Guess what, well, you don't meet Matt anywhere else in this game, which is really freaking bad that they have this guy, and he's not really used that much. I really do say that's disappointment. That's disappointing to me, because, I mean, he seems like a good premise for a, a complete opposite towards Tabitha, who, where Matt has a more manly name than Tabitha. <laughs> well, I was talking with you, our boss, that through his preparations. And you see there, um, there's a spot in the water that we probably will be, we probably will be seeing soon enough that is used for something else for another TM, which is a team unique only to Pokemon and Emerald, or well, the owners. And that, we're able to leave now, so, I got everything we need to get here, so it's best for us to make our, make our way out of here, because there's no point. Now, I would, you know, since there's nothing, there's no reason for us to hang around here anymore, as you, as you see, Team Aqua is gone, so we have done what we need to do involving those two. They've done everything we could possibly do here in Lily Cove, so it, it may be best for me to end it off here, because the next, the next trek of our journey is going to be a really long one, and everyone knows the preparations for another leg of our journey that we'll be doing. So it's like, there's a lot of stuff we gotta be, we're gonna be able to do here now. And as soon as we get the next gym badge, we're gonna have a lot of stuff we're gonna be able to do, so... I think it's best for me just to say, uh... See you guys next time for Pokemon Emerald, we'll, we'll be trekking, our, making our next leg of our journey. Heading... In the, on this route. Heading in the direction... Of Moss Deep City. Our next destination. See you guys then.